So here's the, <coughs> the CAN bus cable. Um, this is the other end of it. So the other end's plugged into the tool head. So um, the problem is, is you can't get this cable through the gland. So there's a gland here that goes up there. There's a gland there that goes up on the um, uh, on the machine, and this has got to go through it to feed back through to your um, board. So the problem is, is you've got this plug here, this little JST 2.5 plug here, which you should be able to see it. Yeah. Um, that's in the way. So first of all, you need to. Uh, what I do. And it's quite tricky. Um, so just with it facing up towards you like this, with the little arrow tangs facing down, uh, facing up, just take note or take a photo of your uh, green and yellow cables. So that's your can low and can high. So green on the left, yellow's on the right in this case. And then what you do is you flip it over. And you'll see that the cables can, I don't know if you can even see that, oh yeah. you see that the cables move backwards and forwards, just slightly. And there's a little wee tang, you can hardly see it. There's a very, very small tang that sits in here, right there, that's poking up, that stops the cable from coming back and it hits this plastic. So what you've got to do, it can be quite tricky to see on the camera because it's so small, is I've just basically put the prong of some sharp tweezers up the, the port you want to take out and then I press into that area and then tug the cable out. Sometimes you've got to give it two or three goes to do it. Well, if that doesn't work, you can actually press down on it like this and then try and give the, the, the cable a tug. It's kind of like a three hand job. There you go. And that's removed it out of the plug. And you basically take both of those out take these up with a little bit of insulation tape and then you can feed it through this gland and plug it back in again. So green's on the right. Oh, sorry, green's on the left with the tangs up. So the other thing is when you put it in, the the um, it's got some prongs underneath. They go towards the arrows of the plug. So with the plug face down in the, the little, um, so you can see the unit, you put the, these tangs in the downward position and it will click back in. So I'm just going to try and take the other one out now because that actually went a lot better than I thought it was going to. So sometimes you've got to push the cable forward in the plug to actually, so you can get to the tang. So I'm just going to push down on here. Yeah, sometimes you've got to give it a couple of wiggles. There we go. And that's removed it. Then we put a bit of tape on here. Tape these up. Put them through the gland. Well, actually, you might be able to get them through the gland without taping them up. Oh, yeah, look at that. Get it through the gland. And then we can plug it back in again. Very difficult to show because it's so small. So this one clicks in. We'll do the yellow one first. And it just clicks into place. 
like that. So this one here, this one here is actually, if you pull a bit of tension on it, it actually hold, locks it in there better. Or sometimes you might have to bend the tang just up when it's out, just bring bend that tang up a fraction to get it to, um, but that's, that's fine. And now I can actually use that and put the glands on the wrong way. <laughs> the glands on the wrong way, I think. Yeah. Yeah. So I've got to take that off again and um, do it again. So just try and, I'll just try and see if I can just do it. The more you, the, the the more you do it, the easier it kind of becomes. So I'll take this gland off, and we'll put the gland in the other way. Give it a bit of a twist and turn as you put it in, and it should feed through. Okay, so we should be able to put that back in again. So tangs down. Yellow. You see that one there is playing up a little bit. You got to be careful if you've got it wrong. So sometimes you can actually reach in, and you might be able to pick that. Oh, now the tangs are actually up now. So that's it. That's ready to install now. So hopefully that helps out. I don't know if we saw any of that. <laughs> 